Admittedly, it takes a lot to disturb the equilibrium of the sober English. It's often said that they'd carry on eating quite unconcernedly if there was a corpse a couple of feet away. And at this restaurant, there is. Still, there's no mystery about this one. It's merely a bullet hole decoy bust of Sherlock Holmes, part of a collection of relics from the famous cases of Holmes, housed today at a public house named after the world's greatest detective. The room is laid out exactly as it was on a typical night in 1897, and the pub itself is part of the site of the old Northumberland Hotel, frequented by Holmes and Dr. Watson, and only a stone's throw from their friend Inspector Lestrade of Scotland Yard. Above the fireplace is a portrait of Irene Adler, to Holmes always the woman, and below it relics like the Persian slipper in which he stored his tobacco, and the poker bent by Dr. Roylott. This reconstruction of the living room at 221B Baker Street, assembled and catalogued by Mr. Lloyd Taylor with the help of the Conan Doyle family, is authentic even to the half-eaten tea. At any rate, if there's any truth in the rumour that Sherlock Holmes was not, after all, killed, falling over the Reichenbach Falls, he'd always have a home to come back to, even if it isn't exactly private anymore.